I think the big issue is that to date, you know, recycling has been much more of, you know, considered a burden. There's always the, the carrot versus the stick approach. And many government agencies up until now have really used the stick side, saying, well, fine you if you don't recycle, we'll punish you if you don't, we'll force companies to use recycled content. But that's really because up until now, a lot of the processes used to recycle batteries were non-strategic. They were really mixing together with other scrap metals, burn a lot of the products, make these mixtures that are then very expensive and difficult to select products out of. But by starting from the fundamentals and really doing a systematic design from the ground up, having our strategic demanufacturing and then recovering each element at a time, we're actually able to operate without charging any type of tipping fee to the owner itself. So up until recently, people who have electric vehicle batteries or even laptop or cell phone batteries in their homes, they would have to you know, pay to have it be processed responsibly. And that put a disincentive on returning those materials back to the market. But by now having this purpose-built system where we aren't required to have them pay a fee and based on commodity metal prices, there are even cases where we can pay them to return a battery, it goes much more to the carrot side and gives people rewards for returning these elements back to the market. And unlike hydrocarbons, which are used once and then consumed, if there's a proper system and architecture in place, these elemental metals can be used indefinitely as they're recovered and extracted and refined back to the battery grade quality and then sold right back into the domestic market. So I think really changing the paradigm about how end of life batteries are treated really does help us make these in much larger quantities domestically, which then brings total costs down, which then brings vehicle costs down and really ends up helping everybody in that full closed loop system.